What is up, everybody? It's DVD Blu-rays, a.k.a. Mr. Nichols. As you guys can see, I got a football helmet on. I'm ready. I'm ready to go. Today, we are going to show you my football movies. Let's go. <sighs> All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed that nice little intro I did there. Yeah, changing it up a little bit. But I have 12 titles for you guys today. All football films. I don't know why I'm doing this, but, you know, I just thought, hey, let's show you guys my football films. Um, I got 12 of them here. I know I'm missing a lot of them, uh, but these are only the ones on Blu-ray. I know there's a lot of great ones out there, like Radio. Radio is a great one. I hope we get that one on Blu-ray one day. Um, I know we have, what else do we have out there? The Program. The Program is a great movie, but that's only on DVD. These are just the Blu-rays, so let's just get right into it. These are not in any order. Um, another one I'm missing is The Water Boy. Uh, I wish that was on Blu-ray. I know you could have got that burn on demand at one time, but I missed out on it. Anyways, not in any order, so let's just get right into it and show you guys what I got here. First up, a great movie, underdog flick here. We got Rudy. Um, you know, this is a really good feel-good movie. Um, good times, man. This good times right here. About a guy, a young guy, a small guy, trying to make it on the football team. He finally does, and he gets, he gets his wish, his dream. <laughs> Next up, we have another movie with George Clooney, Renee Zellweger, and that is uh, Le Leatherheads. Uh, I don't really remember this one, but, you know, we got a football movie here. It looks like it was from back in the day. Well, I mean, obviously not back in the day, but... Um, I'm not sure, but Leatherheads, this is one that I have not seen yet, uh, but I will be pushing, putting this in my in my uh, Xbox real soon and watch it. Next up, we have an all-time classic football movie. If you were a football guy back in the day, if you went to uh, high school football, this was the movie for me back in the day. In my high school, this is a movie we watched all the time. That is a movie with Al Pacino, Dennis Quaid, Jamie Foxx, Cameron Diaz, James Wood, and LL Cool J. That Al Pacino speech, man. If if anything, this is probably in my top five of uh, football movies. But this one right here, if you guys want to watch a motivational movie, or at least a motiva motivational speech, Al Pacino kills it in this one. When I was uh, younger in high school, in my high school days, I downloaded his speech and I put it on my iPod. Yes, iPod. Uh, I'm not sure if you can get it on Spotify, but I'm probably going to have to look that up now. And uh, see if I can get that on Spotify. Um, that speech alone, man, that, that thing got me hyped. I was so hyped after that. Next up, we have a classic comedy. We have The Water Boy. Water sucks. It really, really sucks. Anyway, The Water Boy. This is probably one of Adam Sandler's best movies. Um, <laughs> if you don't think so, comment down below. Let me know your favorite Adam Sandler movie. But this one is pretty good man um bobby boucher boucher foosball is for the devil kathy bates she does great in that one as well um man just a whole bunch of people in this one um who else do we have in here yeah yeah if you guys haven't seen the water boy what's wrong with you stop this video and go watch the water boy right now all right next up we have a triple pack um, I have all these movies except for the one. I'm trying to get this one separate on Blu-ray, but it's out of print right now. So that is Varsity Blues. Uh, Varsity Blues, man. Another great film with uh, Paul Walker uh, before the Fast and the Furious days. Um, just a great high school football film right there. Varsity Blues. Next up, a very sad one. We have We Are Marshall. This is based on a true story um, about a football team. They, they're taking off in their plane, and their plane crashes. Um, the whole team is lost. So we got Matthew McConaughey here trying to rebuild this team, bring the school back together. The school doesn't want anything to do with him. Um, but, you know, he, he brings them all together, and they end up winning a couple couple games. Not all the games, but a couple of them. And, uh, you know, just a really great feel-good film. Um, sad thing is, is, it's actually true. We lost all those people. 
but great motivational. Next up, we have The Blind Side with Sandra Bullock, another based on a true story film. Um, I remember watching this one back in the day. I don't really remember much about it, so I'm going to have to pop this one in soon. But we got The Blind Side here, based on a true story, and um, a really great story from what I heard. Next up, we have another true story. A lot of these are based on true stories. I mean, they're football films, so you can't really mock up a fake film. A fake film. But this is the one with Dennis Quaid. Wow, we have another Dennis Quaid movie. Um, the Express. Uh, the Ernie Davis story. Um, this was about a running back. You know, uh, I think this was during the times of, like, uh, segregation and all of that. I'm not quite sure. It's been a while since I've seen this one. But another movie that is actually a really great film, and I suggest you guys watch it. I'm not. I'm, I'm going to just stop saying based on a true story because all of these are really based on a true story. Next up, we have a Will Smith one. My only slipcover, Concussion, based on a true story. Um, it's about you know all these guys that get concussions and um, uh, CTE. Um, it's that stuff that Chris Benoit had. Uh, a lot of other players had it. Um, obviously, Chris Ball, Benoit wasn't a football player, but um, who else had it? I think Junior Seo had it. Um, but yeah, it, it's about football players that get concussions and, you know, the side effects of it after that. And um, I didn't have too many concussions when I was in football, but I had plenty of them. Um, not enough to affect me in any way, but I mean, who knows? Maybe, but yeah, another great one with, uh, Will Smith there. Next up, we got one with Marky Mark, Marky Wahlberg, Invincible. This is a Disney movie, Disney movie right here. Disney came out with some pretty good sport films back in the day, but this one right here, also based on a true story, my rival team right there. Philadelphia Eagles. I'm a Cowboys fan, as you guys can see. Um, yeah, leave the dislikes right now down below. <laughs> All right. Let me know your favorite team down below. What's your favorite team? I know football season's coming around the corner. Finally got rid of that, you know, C word. So uh, I'm looking forward to going to some games. We got Invincible here with uh, Marky Mark. Another one. Another Disney title with Denzel. That is Remember the Titans. We are the Titans. Oh, my God. This is a great film. Uh, this is probably in my top five right here with Denzel. Denzel did a couple good sport films. Um, but, yeah, wasn't he Coach Carter, too? I, I'm not quite sure. I'm going to have to look that up. Uh, that's just off the top of my head. But I think he was Coach Carter as well. But we have Remember the Titans here. Great film. And last but not least, we've got one more film. This film is a highlight of my life when I was in high school, Friday Night Lights. This film right here, I just got this one in the mail. I had to order it. There was one, another one that I ordered in the mail, but I waited too long to film this video. So we have Friday Night Lights with Billy Bob Thornton. This represents high school football. If you guys have not seen this movie, I suggest you guys, guys go out and buy it. This is a great football film. It's a high school football film. Um... You know, there's a couple of high school fil films out there that are pretty good, but I would put this one at the top. With Billy Bob Thornton, great film. Uh, this one, like I said, guys, check it out if you haven't. But um, I put in another order for some more movies. I'm waiting for it to come in the mail. Uh, the movie that I put in the order for is Gridiron Gang with The Rock. Uh, I'm surprised I did not have that one, but, you know... I was waiting for it, waiting for it, waiting for it, holding off on this video, and it just never came. Um, it still hasn't come, so I don't know. I don't know what's going on with that seller. But right here, guys, here's my stack of movies. A little something different. I hope you guys enjoyed. How you guys doing? Let me know down below. Please like and subscribe down below. Like and comment. I love reading your guys' comments. You guys have a good one. Peace. Well, guys, that was my video for today. And this, this was, uh, not my pickups, but this was my, my football movies right here. Whoa.
cut. 